Millipedes as big as cars. An extraordinary discovery in Northern England. On a beach in Northern England the largest one was found in history of the millipede fossil, which reached sizes comparable to modern cars. The remains of a creature called Arthropleura come from Carboniferous period, approximately 326 million years ago. It is the largest known invertebrate scientists report. The specimen was found on a beach in Northumberland, about 60 kilometers away north of Newcastle. Researchers found fossils of articulated segments and exoskeleton, very similar in form to those found in modern times millipedes. Only three similar fossils have been discovered so far. This new one it is the oldest and largest. The individual segment measures approximately 75 centimeters. On this basis, experts estimate that Arthropleur she could have up to 2.7 meters long and weigh about 50 kilograms. The fossil was discovered in January 2018 in a large block of sandstone that fell off a cliff onto a beach in Howick Bay, Northumberland. It was a completely accidental discovery says Dr. Neil Davies from the Faculty of Sciences Earth in Cambridge, the main author of the article. The boulder fell and cracked, revealing fossil. She was accidentally noticed by one of our former translator students scientist. The research results were presented in the Journal of the Geological Society. During a period when a giant creature walked the world, the Northumberland area enjoyed a tropical climate and lay close to the equator. Invertebrates and early amphibians lived among scattered surrounded vegetation many streams and rivers. The specimen identified by the researchers was found in a fossilized riverbed. It was probably a fragment exoskeleton arthropleur which filled with sand. Thanks why could he set in the rock for so long? The fossil was recovered in May 2018 with permission Natural England and the landowners, Howick Estate. That was amazing exciting find. The fossil is so large that four were needed men to move her to the top of the cliff recalls Dr. Davies. The rock was brought to Cambridge so that it could be investigated in detail. Scientists compared the find with all previous ones records on the topic Arthropleury so they found out new ones things about its habitats and evolution. Previous discoveries suggested that the animal lived in swamps, but the find showed that the invertebrate liked it to open forest habitats near the coast. There are only two other known fossils Arthropleury, both come from Germany and are much smaller than the new specimen. Novo the discovered fossil is the largest skeleton of this species, but still we don't know much about these creatures. Fossils of these giant ones millipedes are rare because after death their bodies tend to dismemberment. Thus, it is likely that the fossil is only the armor that the animal shed as it grew. We haven't found it yet never the head of any specimen, explains Davies. Previously, Scientists hypothesized that it was two huge sizes Arthropleury a large amount of oxygen in the atmosphere corresponds at the turn of the late Carboniferous and Permian. However, the new fossil comes from earlier times, and therefore oxygen cannot be the only explanation. According to researchers, to achieve such large sizes Arthropleur head toe have a diet high in nutrients, we can't be sure what these the animals ate, but there were plenty of nutritious people in the litter of that time nuts and seeds. We also do not rule out that these animals could have been predators and feed on other invertebrates and even small amphibians says Dr. Davies. Arthropleury they walked the earth for about 45 millions of years, after which they became extinct during the Permian period. The reason for their destruction is uncertain, but it may have been caused by global warming, which made it the climate has become too dry. 
It is also possible that the giant centipedes did not survive with reptiles competing for the same habitats. The fossil will be put on public display at the Museum Sedgwick in Cambridge next year.